choosing the best bid strategy for your Google AdWord ads. Let's talk about that right now. Here we have continuing with the ad creation, the bid strategy, and we need to choose the strategy that we want to use. If we click on the drop down menu here, you see that at the top we are presented with a lot of automatic strategies, bid strategies from Google. This works great for some business, but not for another. If you are starting, and this is what we are doing right now, we'll use the manual CPC. This is the cost per click. Every time somebody clicks on your ad, you will be paying an amount of money to Google, and you can decide that here on this bid area. Remember that when we search for keywords, for specific keywords, we have different maximum or minimum bid amounts. So let's say if I use the keyword, for example, digital marketing, the keyword phrase, and you need to have that in consideration when we are using the manual CPC. On the automatic strategy, we have the target search page, lo page location. So Google will optimize the ad in order to show your ad in the first page of Google to target the CPA, ta target ROA, and tracking out ranking share, maximize the clicks on your ad. So it will set the bid to help you uh, get the most click within your budget and maximize the conversions and enhance the CPC. This is all automatic for now. We'll choose the manual, okay? The next step is to choose how much you are paying for each click. Remember that when we use the Google Keyword Planner here, we when we find the keyword, next to the keyword, we have a suggested bid amount. So. If you don't, if you are not sure how much you need to put here, I recommend to start very low. Sometimes if you set a, a low amount here, Google won't even show your ad. So that's why you need to go on Google Keyword Planner right now. If you don't remember how to do it, you can check two videos before this one. We have a complete uh, class showing you how to find the best keywords and how to find the average bid amount for each keyword. So for this test, I will add here $3, okay? Of course, this is up to you and this change depending of your keyword. And next we have the budget, how much you want to spend a day. In this case, I'll say $30, $30 a day is the maximum I can spend and the amount per bid is $3. So one question that people ask me all the time, my students, my clients is, okay, if I set $3 here, that means that every time I will be paying $3. No, that doesn't mean. This is the maximum bid amount. So if you have more than one company bidding for the same keywords, let's say we are, we're, we're talking here about the keyword digital marketing, for example. So we have company A, that is that is targeting digital marketing keyword and they add here two dollars and fifty cents for example per bit and the company b is also targeting digital marketing and they said okay they want to pay up to three dollars here okay so what happened is that because we have company a and b for the uh, fighting let's say for the same keyword and the company b have more is have a have a higher bid for this keyword what happened here is that you know you are not paying three dollars here. You will pay a little bit more than the other the, the other company, which is two fifty. In this case, probably you will pay two dollars and sixty cents or something like that. It's around that amount. Of course, this is just an example. Nobody knows exactly how the algorithm works and how it's calculated. So, but you now have an idea of how the how the bidding works. Okay, so let's move forward here. Next, we have the ad extensions. We are not using uh, this right now in this example, probably later on the course. But if you want to learn more, you can click on take a tour and take a look on that. So for now, we are happy with this. Double check that all is as you want. And when you are ready, click on save and continue and we move to the next area. OK, see you there.